Hello everyone, welcome to yet another 2 Minute Tuesday. Today we're going to be talking about something related to last week's tip, which was about enabling a feature that was not enabled out of the box for Dynamics 365 and the Outlook synchronization with Dynamics 365. So today is related to that. It's, it's another feature that I, in my opinion should be enabled if you are going to be synchronizing um, your Exchange mailbox with Dynamics 365. So when you uh, are working with an appointment, so let me just put up an appointment here. All right, so here's an, an example appointment. In a lot of cases, appointments will have attachments or documents. Like in this case, this is a test appointment I just created. And I just said it's a meeting to discuss the attached agreement. And I have an agreement right here in PDF that we're going to be discussing uh, as part of this meeting. What happens is that out of the box, if you track this meeting, the attachment itself is not tracked as part of it, which is not the way it works for emails. When you track an email, all of the attachments within the email are also pushed to Dynamics 365. Now, the way this is, you know, uh, out of the box again is not tracking uh, documents. Maybe that is to protect, obviously, storage capacities within Dynamics 365. But if you believe that, you know, if you want to see an appointment, you also want to see the documents inside of that appointment and the things that they were just talking about, essentially, on that meeting, then you have to enable that. So let's start the countdown and let's go. So we're going to go back to Dynamics 365. I am going to go into the advanced settings. And again, I'm doing this as an administrator, of course. And within settings, I'm going to go to administration and then system settings. And within system settings, I'm going to click on the synchronization tab. And it's essentially the first checkbox that you see on the list. So there it is. Synchronized appointment attachments with Outlook or Exchange. Pretty simple. Click that on. Click OK. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed the tip this week. Make sure you hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed already. And obviously the like button to let people know that you like this tip. And we'll see you next week.